Welcome to Head to Head, our weekly prediction show. Anise, Gus Malzahn won't admit it, and even Brett Bielema, who loves to flap his gums, is downplaying it this week. But this game is personal. These coaches don't like each other. They may kind of sort of respect each other, but they don't like each other, and they want to beat each other in the worst way. Yeah, and as much as this game is worth to the coaches, I think it is to the fans as well, because this is kind of a, a swing game for both of these teams. This game really could determine the direction of both seasons. All right, so let's break down this game. So Auburn last week, they were they started to look like the team we the Gus Miles on team that we're used to seeing. They were able to put up some points really quick on Kentucky. Um, they didn't have any turnovers, which is a really good thing for Auburn. You know, after what we've seen this year, so maybe maybe they're onto something. I think they've got some confidence for the first time all season on offense. Sean White did some nice things. They ran some pace early against Kentucky. They slowed it down later. But if White can go in there, as he did in Lexington, and they can avoid turning the ball over, that's going to be huge in this game. The amazing thing is that Auburn's 4-2, and two, Arkansas's 2-4, and four, but Auburn's the underdog. And the home field doesn't fully account for that. I think a lot of people feel a little better about Arkansas the way they played against Alabama, even though they didn't win that game. All right, so now for the predictions. So, you know, Sean White, he hasn't had his touchdown yet this season, but I think he is going to get it this game. But I don't think it's going to be enough for Auburn. Arkansas has a really good run defense, which has been Auburn's main weapon this year. So I, I, don't, I think it's going to be close, but I don't think Auburn's going to get it done. So I'm going with Arkansas, 31 to 27. Well, pigs do love slop, and it is supposed to be a monsoon on Saturday in Fayetteville. And in Arkansas, this is really in many ways a bad matchup for Auburn because Arkansas, their defensive front against Auburn's offensive front and vice versa. You would think Arkansas would win the battle of the trenches. They've got the biggest offensive line in captivity and so many things point to them winning this game. But I was really encouraged what I saw from Sean White in that offense. I think they have a pulse. I think they identified some playmakers, namely Carrion Johnson. I think you're going to see a lot of him in the Wildcat. And for some reason, I picked against Auburn by one point in the Kentucky game, went the other way. This time I'm going with the Tigers to get it done. 24-23. If Auburn doesn't get it done, Bielema will never let them hear the end of it.